Good morning, YouTubies. How are you? It's Marie here. It's been a while since I've been on. Uh, if you see my little flying friend, you know, don't worry about it, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, she is flying around this morning. Um, this morning, I had to close the windows be, um, because this morning I got up and there were some crows sitting on my balcony. One was on the ground and the other one was on the railing and they were eyeing um, Francis. Now, crows will go after a starling and they will kill it and, you know, eat it. And Francis saw them and freaked out. Um, and because she was flying around, that's where they took notice. So um, they scared all my birds away this morning because in the morning I feed the birds. Um, yeah. So anyway, I wanted to do a haul video. I This happened a couple days ago, a couple times. And here's Francis. Can you say hi, Francis? Oh, let me show you something because someone had asked me about this. Do you want to eat? Okay, hold on. There you go. You gonna leave? You gonna leave me or you want some more? All right, bye. Um, and that's what I, I, I feed her. She likes to eat off my shoulder. She's spoiled. I'm telling you, the bird is spoiled. This is dog food with a little bit of applesauce. Now she's starting to eat my food. Um, so I give her a little bit of rice and a little bit of chicken and I you know, I'm cut up the chicken a little bit and she'll eat that. Um, she likes to play with my hair. <laughs> um, okay. And she'll fly around. I let her fly around because I put her in the cage and she tries to get out and she's messed up the side of her beak because she sticks it in the, in the bars. So, yeah. Okay, let's get started. I hope you don't mind about the bird, okay? Because she's just part of my life now. And there's nothing I can do about it. So, anyway, I went out and I found me a couple of really nice um, wallets. Because, you know, I like to collect wallets. And um, can you move? Come on, you're in my way. Come on. Um, anyway, I use this hat because she likes to hang. She likes to be on my head. And... Um, I don't mind. I just have a thing about birds crapping on my head. I'm sorry. I just can't deal with that. What I do about my clothes is I took an old towel and I cut um, a hole through it and I just slip it over my clothes so that I can just take some um, baby wipes, which I got real cheap on sale, and just wipe it off. It's no big deal. Because um, she does like to ride on my shoulder, as you can see. And she's picking my glasses and she also like I have these little earrings and I can't wear earrings she will pull them out of my ear and play with them so um, yeah she's interesting I can tell you that so anyway let me show you what I got um, the first thing I got was this mirror it was a dollar and you can shake it around and uh, yeah, I it has a crack right here, but it's, I don't really care. It's it's a nice little mirror, so I went ahead and picked that up. I also got, um, and I'm going to do a video on this, uh, a fossil wallet. It's like a paisley type wallet, and it's made out of coated cotton. Um, and I bought this for a reason. I'm going to have another video up, okay, on this. And it's all um, synthetic material. Uh, um, the next thing I got was, I got another, I got a Kohan wallet, and I got this for another reason, too. Um, this is nice. This was cheap. It wasn't that expensive. I think it was three bucks. And it, Kohan has really nice wallets. They have really nice linings. It has a thing here, and then it has a zip closure, and it has these little things here. Um... I wish it had, the only thing I wish it had was a, was an outside pocket on here. Francis, stop. Come on. Francis, stop. Come on. Come on. I'm not kidding. Um, <laughs> bye. Um, she does have a temper, let me tell you. Anyway, I also found this cup, um, and I got it for a friend. 
and I'm going to send it to her. It just reminded me of my friend. Um, there's a story behind this. You know how you go to a thrift store or something and you have your stuff laid out and you're like, because I'll like grab things and then I'll go through process of elimination or then I'll put things back that I don't want. Come on, off my hair. Um, I had this laying on the table and I was going through my stuff and this woman come by and picked it up. And I'm like, oh, uh, uh, and I said, excuse me, that's my cup. And she's like, oh, I know. Okay, well, but it has a like, picture of my cat on it. And I said, but it's my cup. <laughs> you know, so I just said, well, you know, I have a cat like that too. Because I was thinking of my friend. So, because she's my friend, the cat's my cat too, so to speak, right? So, anyway, she gave it back to me. And, um, yeah, I'm just amazed how people would just come up and pick up your stuff while you're looking at it. I also got these now they were in a bag that I had bought and I don't I don't have the bag anymore but these little pins which I really don't want um, yeah I've got a couple of them and then I got this one here from Leroy Stitch they were actually in a bag I think they were in the coach bag and I just I was pulling things out and I remembered that I had these um, I think they were in the, my coach bag that I bought so, um, I'll sell them to anyone if you guys want them. Anyone wants them. Okay, the last couple of things I want to show you are, you ever like go um, thrifting and you find things and they're like the highlight of the whole shopping trip? You know what I mean? Like, oh, I got this score, this one thing. So, I went two different times and I found some really nice things. So, the first thing I found, um, I'll show this one first. Uh, every time I get one of these, I end up selling them because for some reason, these are probably one of the most popular wallets out there and they are the most sought after, I think because of the way they're made. Every time I've shown one of these, I end up selling it. And this one is a beautiful patent leather hobo wallet. Love hobo wallets. I'm not crazy about their handbags, but their wallets are really, really good. It's the one with the two things here. It's in perfect condition. Um, you've got the card holder. And you've got the, the ID holder or the window. You look inside and it's got the really nice cotton lining. Now this one, I think is one of the older ones. It has hobo here. And the reason I say that is because the older ones have hobo on one side and hobo on the other side. And a lot of times... As the years go on, they kind of start, like, getting rid of certain things in the bag. So you don't notice. Um, anyway, and this will be an, a, an example of what I mean. So you open this up, and it has the zip here. And, yeah, you can put your stuff in there. And I knew this was an older one because when I open this side where it has the cards, it has the cards, it has a slot here and it says hobo, okay? This side, there's also another slot. The older models will have that extra slot. The newer ones won't and the inside material is more like a polyester or synthetic. It's not cotton. So I knew this was an older one. Didn't spend that much on this and it has the nice magnetic insert okay this is patent leather and um i love 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 patent leather um one thing about patent leather and i'm seeing people show on their videos their first videos or whatever there's this new bag by amazon and it has a plastic window on it or the bottom of it is plastic do not put anything that is patent leather in a plastic bag because the color will transfer and it will ruin the bag especially in an area where it's hot okay or you're in an area or you have a uh, a, um, a closet and it gets hot inside the closet um, you want to store this in a cloth um, dust bag or whatever okay do not put these in plastic and also and there's a reason why um, do not lay them next to another one that's got like that kind of um, cover on it 
it'll that'll also transfer so you have to be really careful with um <laughs> she's got my attention right now um with patent leather okay all right the next thing i got and this was half price i got me one of these little um coach i guess it's we can use it for notes and stuff um, and it says um, coach made in China and it had the little boomerang in here the little arrow in here whatever um, anyway it has a card holder here and here and this is an older one um, and this is actually Vaquetta leather it's dyed Vaquetta leather there's a see the difference between that yeah so this was like, I think I paid three bucks for it. Um, and it has a thing here you can put a pen in or whatever. So I really like this. And it has Coach on here. All right. Okay. The last thing I got, and I, there's a story with this one too. I was looking through, they had brought out the bins. And there was a lot of, um, come on, Francis, get off my hair. Come on. Um, there were a lot of bins and they had, um, all these purses and backpacks and everything else on it. Oh, speaking of which, I got a, a backpack. And this was four bucks. And it has inside, it has a thing where you can put your keys. And it has a little thing here, a pocket here. And then there's a pocket on top of here. So, yeah. <laughs> it's really, really comfortable. So, I grabbed that. So, let me go back to where I was. That was one of the stuff that was in this great big... They'll bring out and then walk away and like, put out other stuff. Well, there's a woman there going through and they were picking up everything. Come on. Um, they were picking up everything. She was going through and picking up everything. And she's picking up a bunch of purses, whatever. The little, you know, makeup cases and stuff. And all this stuff. And she was going through. So... I was standing there waiting because I didn't want to be rude and just start like competing with her. I, I'm, I'm not like that. So she went through, got what she wanted and she left. So I went through and it, besides the purses and stuff, there were a lot of ta uh, ties and belts and other things like that. Um, he has to stay on, on the thing here. Um, anyway, I lost my thought. I'm sorry. Um, anyway, I went ahead and started looking. She had found a couple of things, um, that were okay. You know, um, it was like, I think it was a Kate Spade wallet and there was another couple of other wallets. It was like a coach, little coin wallets or whatever. And, you know, I, I didn't care much for those. The little wristlets. There was two of them. She picked those up and then walked away. So I went in and started looking through. Now, you know me, I'm going to go through and go dive through. So I went through and started going through everything. And I found at the very bottom, um, I found a Michael Kors. And this is lambskin. Look at this. Brand new. Um, this is the Savannah. It's from his Savannah collection. It's from 2016. Um, February. And it's, it, I know it's an older one because he has this, see, on both sides. A lot of them now, they'll just have it on one side. So it's 16 or 13, but I think it's 16. Um, anyway, I love the Michael Kors zippers. So you open it up, bam. It's like, really? Um, it has two sections here, card sections. There's like 17 all together. Card sections here, 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 and here. And it has the Michael Kors um, thing in here. So I knew this was the top of the line. It wasn't, like maybe I could, this would be something I'd find at Lord and & Taylor's. Um, and maybe this was donated from Lord & Taylor's. I don't know, because they closed their stores. Um, or they would have taken them to Macy's. But you have a place here, and then there's another place here. So, yeah. Uh, this retails for two hundred and twenty-eight dollars. I looked it up, and I got it for six. So it pays um, to go through and dig through 
things because you never know what you're going to find. And like I said, this is probably, this is brand new, hasn't been used, which means there's probably a purse somewhere at a Goodwill, a uh, Savannah purse. Um, but I do do like this. So it has all the room and it has a, a thing here. I can a little picture thing. So anyway, that is my haul video and beating my bird video. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed it. Um, many of you have had questions about the bird. I will do a video on Frances. Um, yeah, she's like new. Uh, here's my hair. She's like, you know, new. She keeps me busy. Um, I've had to like adjust everything and now I'm going to have to like redo my altar because she like colors them up. You know what I mean? Um, so I have to redo my altar so she doesn't mess up my statues. So anyway, um, yeah. So anyway, I hope you all have a good one. I will have more videos up because I want to do one on the Kate Spade wallet. And, um, I'm probably going to do a cleaning video on this one. Um, I've been using my long chomp bag, so, yeah. So, Brett, you want to say goodbye, Francis? Can you say goodbye? Hmm? All right. Okay, so, you all have a good one. I'll talk to you soon, okay? Bye.